All right, before I get into what I want to talk about, I have a show tonight at La Reunion at 10 o'clock. And what we're going to talk about today is how to be supportive for an artist in a way that means the most. And the name of that game <clears throat> is Quality Over Quantity. The first space you can help them out is in their social media. If you see a band that you really like, comment, say how much you love them every time, say what you liked about the video, but engage with them because they wanna hear it. They wanna know what their actual fans are thinking. It doesn't matter if there's one person, it doesn't matter if there's 10. My mom's all over my social media. She's always saying the same thing. Then maybe show their content to your friends or whatever and discuss it with your friends and maybe give that feedback back to the artist because more than likely they're going to see it and they're going to hear about it and they're going to want to talk about it, especially if they're like a smaller indie artist. And that way you have like a really close community of people like, oh, we're just working our regular jobs but we got these artists out here just hanging out. They're our friends we hang out with on the weekends, you know. They'll hang. Trust me. They'll always want to hang. That's how you make it organic. That's how you make it chill. It's quality over quantity. You know, it's about how much your fans are with you the whole time. The second space is when you physically see them. Money is cool. That's great. Uh, hopefully, the artist has a way for someone to buy into their thing that they're doing. Not just their merch, you know, and traditional means and ticket sales and that kind of thing. But the dollar a month subscription thing that they have on their QR codes or their... Uh, their funds and their links and stuff that that goes a long way because that it keeps them accountable to make sure that they're in touch with their fans because at the end of the day artists whether or not they realize this it's a love it's a love relationship between the fan and the artist you know we make the music we make <clears throat> hopefully for you know a good amount of you that enjoy it enough right enough that you would want to invest into it and if there's enough of you well we would like to go procure venues and we would like to go procure places and make sure that the merchandise we're giving you is something that is useful to you and things that you would like not just for money it's not about money it's about making sure that you guys are taken care of because of the love that you're outpouring through a like and a comment you know or just showing up to things because that's the beauty of a live show and the being invested with an artist it's being in with the music that they're making because you think that their music is adding something to your life you know so while money is important it's not about the amount it's not about the amount it's it's about accountability on the artist end of being like oh these are people who are like really invested in what I'm doing it is my duty and due diligence to make sure that I'm doing things in their favor right because that's who's supporting me that's why artists on the big stages and on small stages that's why they're always saying without you guys it wouldn't happen and the big takeaway from this video is if you see something you like don't be afraid to tell them don't be afraid to say hey I really enjoyed what you were doing let me follow you let me figure it out it's the best feeling in the world it really is that they they will go bands will go do free shows They'll, do, they'll go do free shows at a loss just to see if they can get some people to follow along on their social media. You know, I understand that sometimes you know it, gets, it turns into a numbers game, but it doesn't have to be that. It can be quality. It can be organic. It can be a nice grassroots build on what you're doing. And to know that you can go to any city around the country, especially if you know, your music gets out, you know, fortunately enough, that you can be at a venue and it's a room full of people you get to see every month or every other month or once a year, you know, in multiple cities. Catch up with them, how their lives are doing. That's the whole point. It's about relationship, you know.